ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Korea. No, Georgia. Sorry, Georgia. 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 Yay. Okay, I can see a bright light in front of me. It must be time to go. <clears throat> um. <laughs> so I got into trouble the other day. I did what Scott did. I referred to my, my partner as my current partner. Um, <clears throat> we've only been together for 12 years. <laughs> but you never know, something better just might come along. Tomorrow, George, you better watch out because you might be history. Anyway, it's, it's really great having a, a partner from another country. It's better than TV. My guy's German, and so is BS. Um, he's so funny, but he's got no idea. <laughs> That's why he's current. But um, <clears throat> when we first started going out, <clears throat> he used to call his seven-year-old son a little bugger quite often, and I'd sort of I'd let it slide until one day <clears throat> he called me a little bugger, and I said, how dare you? Do you know what a bugger is? And he goes, hmm, I think it's like a, it's a little a, a gnome or something. All the kids, all the parents at school are calling their kids little buggers. I said, mate, you've got no idea. You're barking up the wrong tree. A bugger is a bloke who fucks somebody up the ass. It's, it's bum sex up the back passage. So I'm packing fudge up the poo shoot. The look on his face was, you know, he was horrified and the look was just pure magic. <laughs> he had no idea. He couldn't believe that Australians <clears throat> would um, call their kids little ass fuckers as a, as a term of endearment. <laughs> He's got a point there, it's kind of like, you know, it's kind of like saying, oh, isn't she a cute little cocksucker? <laughs> well, come, come over here, you little dickhead. <laughs> come on, motherfucker, it's time to go home. <clears throat> um, so, anyway, I asked him, what do, what do Germans call their kids when they're, you know, when they're being a bit naughty? And he goes, well, you can say, Come here, Schweinhund! <laughs> I love that one. That's pig dog. Or you can say, get over here now! Um, what's it called? Drecksack! Drecksack. Dirty bag. That's isn't that great. Or, um, <laughs> get out! Sarkel! That's, that's pig guy. I think, you know, the pig is a, it's a really common put down in German. And um, that used to be my favourite put down when I was eight as well. So, um, yeah, there was this real bitch living up the road, this girl called Simone. And she had a horse, and I didn't, so I hated her guts. And I had this protest rally in the backyard against her. It was back, back before the days of online bullying. And I had to use actual cardboard. But I wrote these placards, and the first one said, Simone is a pig. And the second one said, Simone smells like a pig. And the third one said, Simone fucks pigs. <laughs> well, she did. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm from Mullen and when, when I had my, um, my baby, um, my first baby, and not only did I get to go home with a baby, but I got to take the placenta home with me because um, it's mandatory take, to take the placenta home these days. But um, I just couldn't decide what to do with mine. Like, I wanted to plant a tree on it, but I just, I just you know, I was very, you know, post, you know, post, you know, having the baby, I just couldn't decide. Um, anyway, seven years later, I, I found it at the back of the freezer and gave it to the kids for dinner. <laughs> Not really, no, but really, you know what the thing is these days, though, it really is. Like, you, 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 you take it home and you, um, you cut it up and you dry it and you can use it as a natural remedy for when your kids get sick. Like, like poor little Malachi. Not, not only does he wake up with the flu, <clears throat> he's got a wee grated dried placenta on his porridge as well. <laughs> if I had to read that, I think I'd even get over viral meningitis. It'd be like, <clears throat> oh mum, bit of a headache, bit rashy, but I'll be right. <laughs> Thanks.